Questions for Derek? Will you take us through the last two possessions from your perspective? Um, Jason. Start with the foul? Yeah. Or the, okay. Um, yeah, I mean, got it to JT at the top, and he's special. Yeah, he made a big play. Um, and we have all the faith and trust in the world in him, and he got a good look and knocked it down for us. And then I knew they didn't have any timeouts, so I was just trying to make it tough. And I mean, it looked good from the moment he shot it, but thankfully it was after the, after the buzzer. I didn't know at the time, but thankfully. I know you're a little new to the rivalry, but is it sweeter beating Philly, especially in Philly? Uh, yeah, it's a big win. I mean, they're a really good team. Um, it's always fun to beat good teams. Um, obviously, the crowd and everything adds to it, but um, they're a really good team, and so we're out there competing. It's a, it's a big win for us. On that last play, what's kind of your role in it, and how much have you guys worked on that this year? I think you ran against Cleveland too late in that game. Um, my role is just get it in bounds. Um, in space, but uh, yeah, we worked on it and got some got a good look off of it. Rotations, you know, the team's fully healthy now. You're coming off the bench again. Uh, you have that great run out there with Brogdon, and then you know, bring Smart in that closing lineup out. How's that kind of been communicated within the team? Kind of some of the new rotations and minutes the guys are playing now. Um, I mean, we understand that a lot of talented guys on the team um, you can't play everybody. You know, so some nights it's going to be you, some nights it's going to be. Malcolm, so that's going to be Sam. Like, it could be anybody, and we trust everybody on the team. So, um, just that understanding, and every time I'm out there, I uh, just try to bring the same energy and effort and um, try to help the team every, every minute I'm out there. You guys have had a lot of success defending Tigers Maxey and, and pretty much three of these matchups. What has led to your defensive success at this time? We're just competing. Um, he's a good player. Um, yeah, he made a, a, a couple of big shots for them that kind of got them back into the game there when we were on a run, and um, we're just out there How were you able to impact the game immediately, the moment you came in? Just being aggressive, you know, getting stops, running, taking what defense gives me, um, doing things that, that I've been doing all year. What happened to your neck? It looks like you got scratched. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't even know it happened. Um, I was on uh, some time out, and everybody was like, oh, get your neck. And I'm like, how am I looking at my own neck? But um, <laughs> I guess it's there, and I'll be all right. Though. So it doesn't hurt or anything? Nah, nah, I'm all right. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> a good question. You, huh? <laughs> <laughs> all right. What was the game plan against Joel, and how do you feel it went? He's good. Um, trying to make it as difficult as possible for him. Um, on the things and give his boy to coverage, but just try to make it difficult for him. Is Joe as intense inside the huddle as he is, I mean, in those moments in this game? Um, he had kind of got a little calm sense to him when, he, when he's down there. I mean, always there's times when um, he's getting, getting after us, but um, he also has that calm and sense, and um, it's fun playing for him.